Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to create the compass. You can see at the corner there is the compass where I can show the direction really accurate and it it follow all the directions. And you look at the top, the green color part. This is also a compass where I can show you the numbers or the angles of degrees for any directions. This is very important in your game developing process and start from now I'm going to show you step by step how to create all of this the directions and compass. Alright now I'm, go I'm going to close everything and I will restart the Unreal Engine. I'm start everything from beginning. This is the Unreal Editor. I'm going to show you really step by step. I create a new game and I will create a third person game. This is a, a fresh new game and I will name it as Compass Demo 01. Create a new project. This is a third person game project. Alright now, this this new game already, this new game project already started. Before we start, you have to go and create the pictures. Alright now, you need to have three pictures. The first picture is an arrow. This arrow is a PNG where you can Google search the arrow up. The arrow up PNG, make sure that the background is transparent. And the next one is the compass, the compass 360. It is something like this. What you need is this part. You need to have uh, this type of the compass. And the next one is a normal compass. So the normal compass you also can find it from the Google image. Compass and you just need to go and find one as long as you like it it's fine but always remember always choose the, the pictures that under creative commons license that allow you to use it for your game project and commercial okay so once you already get once you already get these three pictures or any of the similar picture then you can start the first step what you need to do is to create a wid widget you back to the content folder here you right click create a new folder name it as compass widget all right enter it before we start you have to import the three pictures into that these three pictures, I view in a large icon. I select everything. You name it the first one as arrow, compass 360, and compass normal. Select everything and import into this folder. Now, next, you right click, create a blueprint. Sorry, what is that? Create a user interface widget. Okay, again, right click, user interface widget blueprint and you name it as compass widget all right next you double click in for this time just have a look this is your can canvas and so what you are going to do is from your folder here you drag in all the pictures, drag in the arrow, drag in the compass 360, and also drag in the compass normal. Next. Now you, you have all of this. Next, you are going to resize it. For this time, the size Y and size, size X and size Y should be the same. You put 400 and 400. For this one, or if you feel too big already, you can put it smaller, like 200, 200, because this is going to put at the corner here. Just have a look. 
this is to put at the corner and the next one this one what we are going to do before we start we just adjust this you can see what is this once you point on it you rename it properly press F2 this one you name it as compass 360 and this one is image 2 you press F2 to rename it as compass normal and what about this this is image 0 you press F2 to name it as arrow we make it simple and next we are going to create create an image a canvas panel so here you type in canvas panel you drag in okay drag into here the canvas panel and then you set a certain size like this all right then put into here for this part what you want is here and this part we limit it in this way alright once you've done this part the canvas panel what you are going to do is drag the, the compass 360 into the canvas panel and you click the canvas panel this part now it is inside here you drag in you click the, the canvas panel make sure you already put it in a perfect location the, the panel the panel itself you also move it to to a good location now the canvas itself you should put it at the center here and let's have a check again this part you want something like this okay then you click the image to push it up all right click the image to standardize it make sure you can see the end click the canvas again you make it up a bit click the image down a little bit now you can see this corner touch here this corner touch the border as well the canvas this corner touch the border this corner also touch the border and you can see the end okay, this one down a bit click the image up a bit make sure you can see the end that is the most important now next you click the canvas and drag here down the clipping you choose clip to bound we just want like this all right next this arrow you make it smaller and then you put it at here and inside here is the compass 360 you change the opacity that is under the, the appearance color and opacity you can make it green color the opacity you drag it here to make it less then click OK now you can compile it at this time you can save it and minimize it temporarily next what we are going to do is open the level blueprint it's at here open level blueprint the first thing what you need to do is create a variable and this variable you name it as compass reference then you click here the variable type you choose compass widgets then click compile next 
you right click here type in begins and choose event begin play then you drag here down type in create widgets choose this and here the class you choose compass widgets next drag here down and set set compass reference this is the variable set compass reference and join here next you drag here down add to view port and the target you have to drag here now we done the widget part next what we are going to do is set the rotations if now you compile it and save compile and save you minimize it once you try to play you can see the compass the compass are already there but it won't rotate it won't move so now we want to make it move you have to back to your back to your third person map example this is the level blueprint you want to set certain rotations so under your level blueprints, you right click, choose event tick, create an event tick. Next, at here, you have to get the player camera. Right click, you type in get player camera manager. This is very important. Then right click here get actor locations you delete this and here you join in get actor location get the player camera manager next here you have to break break the rotator here it untick here break rotator okay, now what is this break rotator This one delete first and here rotation from X vector here drag in get actor location sorry get actor rotation This is a mistake, not locations. We we want the rotations. Now delete everything first. We want get actor ro rotations. This is a rotation. We want to find out the angle. Here, drag here down, drag here out, break, rotator. Alright. Now what we want is the Z. Here we need to have a have a Multipl multiply by negative one. You use float. Multiply. Okay, this one. Float multiply the float. The, the, the bottom we put negative one. Because when the when the player rotates, the compass should rotate in a different direction. So you have to make a negative here. And what we want is the Z. The Yaw here next one you right click here set render transform okay here you have to 
set render transform angle set here and then this is the angle the angle is totally different direction the, the angle of the compass rotation is totally opposite opposite of the, the player's rotation so we have to multiply negative one to get the angle the angle of the z if you don't understand about the rotator you can go to the google and search about the theory now i will show you here go to the image.google.com and here you can search for unreal engines were as this now because the player's rotation is the z axis that is the yaw so the rotation is is counterclockwise sorry the rotation is clockwise so the compass should be opposite counterclockwise here we close it first and the target finally we want to set the target the target should be you can check back this the target should be the compass normal and also the compass 360 so here we back to we back to the third person example map here this is the level blueprint the target you can drag here the first one compass normal get compass normal and one more is compass 360 these two we want it to, to rotate all right and what is the target <coughs> the target is the compass reference you drag here down get compass reference and join them together now the event take you connect it together everything done you can compile both side also compile save both side also save and so now you you try to minimize and test play your game now you can see your compass already work all right i press escape and i try to launch with a stand as a stand alone game so that you can see the full screens and see the effect of the compass the whole compass play and wait for a while it is starting the, the game and now everything start i press alternate to enter to enter the full screen and now you can see you already have a really accurate compass like pubg style you can see look at the angle it is totally 360 degree okay first you face to the north you look at the, the compass at the at the corner and the compass at the top both it will rotate accurately all right that's all for today about how to how to create any of the compass save and play like a pubg style as i demo just now that's all for today about how to create a compass with the pubg style and also create a normal compass at the corner and this is the ultimate solutions of the compass in your game developing process in your unreal engine game project and that's all for today thank you for watching if you love my video tutorial if you feel all these tutorials are really helpful to your 3d animations and game developing you can subscribe to my youtube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time i publish a new video tutorial you receive a notification immediately See you in my next video. Enjoy happy animations and game developing. See you.